Hello everybody! Welcome back to my channel. Because the holidays are fast approaching and I know a lot of you have travel plans of your own, don't worry, I've got you covered. Quite literally. Today I am going to take this lovely scarf and show you four ways to get creative. So keep watching! First way is the simplest way, so let's start with that. All you have to do is to take both ends of the scarf and tie a little knot together. And then you take that hole, put your arms through it, and drape it over your shoulders. And now you have a super cute maxi vest that you can wear as a cover up over your swimwear or throw it over a dress for some light layering. Way number two is to take that same vest. Pull it over your head and twist it to the right or to the left, it doesn't really matter. Adjust it so it covers your girls. And voila! You have yourself an instant backless cover-up. I can already imagine this looking so cute with your hair tied up and some statement earrings or with a nice gold slim belt for a night out. The third way to get creative is to again take that same vest. Grab the bottom ends and fold it halfway upwards. Cross one end over the other. Here it is again up close so you guys will really know what I'm talking about. Bring both ends to the back and tie a knot to keep it in place. And then tuck that knot in so it doesn't show. And here it is, a mini dress that you can wear to the beach or to a fun girls night out. My fourth and last scarf trick is, again, to take that all out and start with a vest. Grab a part of the middle section from each side and make sure it's not folding weirdly at the back. Tie a knot in the front and pull it closely towards you. And you know what? Double tie it for good measure. And there you go! An instant midi dress for nice dinners on the beach or, you know, more of those girls' nights out. One scarf in four ways. Ta-da! Bye, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Safe travels and see you guys next time.